All right, so what I got here is my E-Revo. This thing here is about seven years old. It's a mutt. It's got pieces from everything on there. It's got summit wheels and a summit body, and I've also been running my um, Revo 3.3 body on there. That's why it's on the back, but I've been using that. This is the original E-Revo body that I had on it. it was so pounded. Uh, this thing's been through three chassis. It's been through two ESCs, um, million A arms, probably four sets of drive shafts. Um, it's got some miles on it. Still works just fine though. So I finally found it about time to upgrade. Let's open this bad boy up. bag of goodies you get with all their stuff. Parts book, about the controller, batteries, your uh, battery holders. Pretty small bag of tools with this one. The First year Evo I bought, uh, the Summit, the 3.3, even the e Revo VXL 116, I think probably came with more tools than this. Not that I need them, I have plenty of tools, but the decals that come with all of them. Look at that thing, huh? Wow. I've never used one of these clipless bodies before. That's super easy. I wanted the green one. I think this looks badass. Their newer top qualifier. You have to buy this thing separately to Bluetooth hook it up to your phone. This thing is beautiful. Let's get some close up. All right, let's get in on this thing. One of the things I liked about this was that they started using the oversized bearings in their hubs, finally. And they got these big steel drive shafts. One of the biggest things I had trouble with with my older Evo was these drive shafts, man. I could not keep up with the plastic drive shafts. And every time I bought metal ones, they still crapped out on me. 
Never had good luck with them. I like that this comes with the braces already. Front and rear. The top of your, um, your body here. This part rests right in here. So when you do a, when you have a crash there, it has that support. Um, I don't have any of the newer Traxxas uh, batteries with the ID connectors. I'll be running the old ones. Um, and I'll show you what I am running for batteries right now. I don't have any 3S's for it, but I plan to. I think this is, I think this is still a Mama Monster motor, even though Traxxas has their name on it. I do believe that is a Traxxas, I mean a uh, Mama Monster motor still. And I kind of wonder if uh, this ESC is also just uh, a Mama Monster that, because Traxxas and them, like, had a good relationship or something that they worked together and came up with this thing that's got like all of your your amp lights and bolt and temp all that stuff so that's that's pretty cool all right. one thicker plate there and I like that you don't have to mess with the uh, adjustment on the On the spur gear anymore it's not that slotted uh, thing that was in there before as long as you use the gear meshes that they recommend you should just be able to unbolt that guy there and it'll mesh up perfectly can't wait to go and pound on this thing these will be what I'm running for a battery right now I have two of these the other one's charging right now so I can go tear it up um, yeah, the, I'm, these are good batteries. Had pretty good luck with Venom batteries. And let's uh, let's so compare like the two. new one. Is just a little bit longer. The tires look beefy on on the older one because those are Summit tires. Um, I've chewed up. That's another thing that has stunk about switching over to the the Mama Monster there with some Lipo batteries. This thing will chew up tires. So I'm glad that they finally uh, upgraded these tires. These these feel nice. They might last a little bit longer. Those aren't going to last very long, but they're the nicest set of tires I had for it right now without having to go out and buy something. I feel like that's my fans a little ghetto, but the motors still look just about the same. And this is. This is a fan that I took off the ESC that crapped the bed on me. I just popped the top off of that and made the cover go over this motor and yeah, it works. There's your differences there. You got braces and and this doesn't. I just bought these arms for this thing too. So I'll be curious to see if I might be able to switch these arms over to this the arms are compatible but the hubs are not the drive shafts on the new Revo do not fit through the old drive shaft bearings probably go ahead and take this bumper right off of this guy and slam it on there just so that I'm good with that right off the bat but yeah these things are a ton of fun man